Now, live, this is NBC5 News at 10. A trip to the grocery to get eggs and milk can now include a checkup. Two medical clinics are now up and running right inside Dallas grocery stores. For some people, it could be the perfect prescriptions for better health. NBC5's Todd Wallace has the story. I put it hot. Seven-year-old Natalie doesn't feel well, even running a fever. I'm cold and then I'm hot. So her mother has taken her to get a checkup. But this is not a hospital or even a doctor's office. This medical facility is right inside the Carnival Grocery Store on Webb Chapel Extension in Dallas. Well, you need your milk, your bread, now you can come and get your health care too. Corporate Clinical Director Lisa Taylor says this is the second Med Basic Clinic to open in the Metroplex. The citizens that we've serviced so far have absolutely loved it. Uh, we're right here when they need us, where they need us. Here, a physician assistant treats basic illnesses. Colds, flus, allergies, shots. Um, we've done a couple of sports physicals. And can catch the dangerous ones. Diabetes and hypertension, and we've seen some that have never known they were either diabetic or hypertensive in a crisis state. And a trip to the grocery store is far less intimidating to a child than a trip to the doctor's office. Still, Med Basics does have its critics. The American Academy of Pediatrics has spoken out against retail medical clinics, questioning the quality of care. Taylor says the clinic can be the doorway to the health care system. If we can help people find primary care providers, whether they be pediatricians, internal medicine, then that's our job. Natalie doesn't feel better just yet, but her mom feels good about having access to health care that's convenient. Right here is open and that's better for me because... I come into the store and then I come into the doctors. A prescription for good health right on the shopping list. Todd Wallace, NBC5, Dallas. For more information about Med Basics locations, go to our website, NBC5i.com. Click on the news links.